Okay, so this is what I meant by the panning. Uh, I've got one central screw underneath that I just nip up so it's not too tight, not too loose. And then you can just rotate the housing on the base like that quite smoothly. I use two hands, but I've got one holding the camera, obviously. Uh, and I do that not really to get panning shots, um, but often I do it just because the tripod's already set up somewhere and I don't want to move the legs. So I can actually just line the camera up and then get a static shot without having to move the legs again. Um, so I'll just show you underneath. That's the single screw right there. Uh, and then if I take that off completely and lift the housing off, what I did to make it more smooth, I just got a piece of plastic which came from a stationery shop and then I took it to a guy in the shopping mall who fixes shoes and he glued that down and that's like two years ago and it's done loads of diving and it's still stuck firm so that guy's got good glue uh, and it's just a bit smoother with that than it is um, just on the aluminium itself and then I'll just show you quickly what I meant about the legs um, tightening on that Zen base um, if you're in line with the post it just spins when you try and tighten it up you have to be out of line like that and then when you turn it the, 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 this post this post here um, stops the clamp from twisting so you can tighten it and loosen it but as soon as you go in line it just doesn't work so you need two hands 